Cadmium is a naturally occurring element found in the Earth's crust. It is a soft silver-white metal that was used in paint pigments and as a substitute for tin in World War I. Today, about three-fourths of cadmium is used as an electrode component in some types of batteries, with the remainder used in pigments, coatings, and platings, or as a stabilizer for plastics. Workers in many industries face potential exposure to cadmium. The potential for exposure is highest among workers in electroplating, metal machining, plastics, ceramics, paint, and welding or soldering operations. Workers may also be exposed to cadmium from the smelting and refining of metals or from air in industrial plants that manufacture batteries, coatings, or plastics. Workers involved in landfill operations, the recycling of electronic parts, or the recycling of plastics are also at risk for potential exposure. Exposure to cadmium that may be dangerous to life or health can occur in jobs in which workers are exposed to cadmium dusts or fumes. Workers can also be exposed by the incidental ingestion of dust from contaminated hands, food, or cigarettes. The primary and most serious adverse health effects of long-term exposure to cadmium include kidney dysfunction, lung cancer, and prostate cancer. Cadmium may also cause local skin or eye irritation and can affect long-term health if inhaled or ingested. The Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry has estimated that more than half a million workers in the United States face exposure to cadmium each year. OSHA estimates put the number at 300,000. There are government standards regarding worker exposure to cadmium in the United States. To learn more about cadmium exposure risks or other health and safety, environmental, or indoor air quality issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.